Good day to all of you. Today, we are going to make a ribbon wire preparation. So, we are going to prepare a ribbon wire. Let us start. The tools and materials. For ribbon wire preparation, so we have the wet rugs, solder iron, soldering stand, long nose, diagonal side cutter, uh, lead, and our ribbon wire. Okay, our ribbon wire. So we need to cut the ribbon wire into two. So we separate the uh, first half. Okay, and we use the second half as a practice material. Okay, so you can use the second half when you are ready to do your final output. So, we first separate the wires one by one using your hand or by using the long nose pliers. So, we separate the wires around an inch. Okay? So, we separate the wire around an inch. Okay? So, hold the wire firmly, no? Around an inch. So, you can control the splitting of the wires. Okay, so next, so let us say uh, you find it difficult to split a certain wire, so you can uh, use your diagonal side cutter to split it, okay? So now, since we are done splitting all the wires, okay, we start removing the insulation of wires one by one so we cut the insulation of wire wire one by one around a centimeter okay around a centimeter so we place our long nose uh, around a centimeter then while we are pulling the insulator so twist it okay while pulling it gently so again do not remove it completely so you can uh, have uh, a better way of twisting the wires okay so then so again before we start our soldering activity do not forget to wear your mask okay so do not forget to wear your mask and before we use our soldering iron so we make sure that our soldering iron is ready okay so by Again, uh, wiping it stiff on the uh, wet rugs, okay? So, we can also uh, apply a little solder on the tip so we can, uh, so we can maintain the sharpness of our soldering iron, okay? So, we coat the wire. So, after coating the first wire, continue to the second wire. By doing the same steps made on the first wire. Okay, so what are we going to do? So, again, we simply cut the, uh, the insulator or the insulation of the second wire. Then gently pull it while twisting it. Okay, so you'll be able to see that... Uh, twisting the wire a small wire like the ribbon wire is better when uh, we are twisting it while the insulator is still there okay now so we need to coat okay the the wires that we uh, remove the insulation okay so do not forget to wipe your soldering iron okay there it is you apply the soldering iron on the wire the same with the lead or the solder okay so from time to time we uh we wipe the tip of our soldering iron okay so there it is so it's almost the last wire okay when our soldering iron is not in use, okay, 
So, we place it on its holder. Okay? Mm, the solder holder or the soldering stand. So, to keep us safe from burns. Okay? And to keep our tool safe. Okay? That's the safest uh, place to uh, locate or to place our soldering iron. Okay? So, we are on the last wire, no? Just do the same steps until you are able to coat all the wires. Okay? When you are able to coat everything, all the wires, so, you're done with the activity. Okay? So, just follow the soldering iron, no? While applying the lead. Okay? So, then wipe your soldering iron on the wet rugs from time to time. Okay? And then we place it on the soldering stand. If you feel that your soldering iron is too hot, so you can unplug it. Okay? You can also unplug it. Okay, now it's done. Okay, congratulations. Okay, so there it is. So watch it. So everything is coated. Okay, so everything is ready. Congratulations.